For the last few months, we've been traveling around the state and visiting high schools, northeast, south, and west. And it, it's really been eye-opening and so wonderful to connect with uh, the students and the principals and the teachers. All right, good morning. For us, you know, we're, we're rural. You know, we're kind of isolated. And, you know, we have to work with our students to ensure that they know that they are as competitive of graduates as, as any student graduating in, in New Hampshire. There's a lot of people, a lot of opportunities. By hearing the, the kids' stories and what their day-to-day -day kind of lives look like, that's what's going to be memorable for the students and, and that's going to paint the picture of what life could be like at UNH. It was great because like they're just so natural and like completely just open and honest. <laughs> I think that it's a more accurate representation of what the college is actually like and it shows you more of what the students and community is like. I didn't know a lot of the statistics and I thought that since there were 15,000 students that there wouldn't be such a small like 18 to 1 student to teacher ratio. Well the message that we would like students to take away from our visit today is that number one they certainly can go to college and number two that there's a really great set of opportunities at the University of New Hampshire and number three that they can almost certainly afford to come because of all the programs that we have of scholarships and financial aid at UNH. I feel better about especially like the cost of college knowing that they're the scholarships to help people who don't make a certain amount of money. It just puts me at ease knowing I can maybe afford college a bit more than I was able to before. This is really one of our major components of Embrace New Hampshire. I don't see this initiative ending. I see us doing this for many years so that there can really be a nice connection between the university and the high schools in this state.